you, but but one thing that. we can say, right, is that because you can only have one shared library, mm -hmm. that is really something that's more of a long term solution right. that you right. put in place is like if let's say if if uh, I wanted to share with my husband or with Amy or right. something like it's a long term thing that's more meant to be more permanent because it's mm -hmm. ongoing when you are doing either a shared album or an iCloud link is because you're really wanting to shoot some pictures over to somebody else. Mm -hmm. that and you just need to give them access to it so they can do whatever they want with them right so i think the first decision you have to make is it permanent or is this temporary right mm -hmm. and if it's permanent we go automatically to shared library if that's available mm -hmm. if it's temporary now that the option is do we really just need to send them a link to download these photos right. which is where the link can kind of come in handy or do we need to sort of make an album where we're merging uh, you know, from maybe an event or a trip. So right. I feel like still shared albums might be best for an best event like trip. that or a trip like that. Yeah. But then mm -hmm. you have those limitations of, you know, like sizing yeah. and, and that type of stuff, right? So yeah. it it, it kind of depends on the scenario, but I think permanent versus temporary is like the big thing there. So that um, was probably my best option for, yeah. for like a trip like that. 